This video is the graphical abstract that accompanies the paper MultiDIC, an open source toolbox for multi-view 3D digital image correlation. MultiDIC is a MATLAB toolbox containing all the necessary scripts and functions for performing 3D DIC from images acquired by multiple camera pairs. The toolbox offers the capability to easily calibrate a multi-camera setup and automatically merge surfaces reconstructed by different camera pairs a functionality which is not typically offered in other 3D DIC software. MultiDIC is available to download for free from GitHub. The algorithms implemented in MultiDIC include distortion correction, stereo calibration, digital image correlation, 3D reconstruction, and post-processing. This allows users to go all the way from raw images to 3D surfaces. In the post-processing step, full field displacement deformation, and strain results can be both exported and visualized. The toolbox utilizes code from the MATLAB computer vision toolbox and the open source packages NCORE and Gibbon. The capabilities of MultiDIC tested in this paper utilized a low-cost multi-camera stereo system featuring 12 Raspberry Pi camera modules connected to a PC. The illumination of the measured object was provided by flexible LED total cost of the system was under $1,000. In this video, we show an example of an in vivo 360 degree DIC measurement using the 12 camera rig. We applied a speckle pattern to the lower limb of a human subject and image of the leg while the subject performed ankle plantar flexion. Here, you can see how 2D DIC is used to find the correspondence of a dense set of points on images taken by two different cameras, positioned posteriorly to the leg. The correspondence is also tracked across time steps. Accuracy of correlation between corresponding points across images is depicted by color. Blue color represents highly accurate correlation between points, while yellow color represents low correlation. This figure shows the same point matching procedure for another camera pair, positioned anterior to the leg. Using stereo triangulation, these match points on pairs of stereo images can be used to reconstruct the 3D positions of the points in a global coordinate system. In this figure, each color represents a point cloud reconstructed from one camera pair. 12 cameras are sufficient to reconstruct the full 360 degree surface of the shank. The point correspondence on the images also define a tessellation that is then transformed into 3D triangular meshes which may have overlapping regions. Any overlapping meshes are automatically merged together by resolving the overlaps and stitching together any gaps using Delaunay triangulation. The dynamic 3D positions of reconstructed points are used to calculate the 3D displacement field. On the right is shown the displacement magnitude of this vector field, and on the left, these values are mapped back to source images from two of the cameras. The displacements are then used to calculate the local 3D deformation and strain of each triangular element. The figure on the right shows the dynamic values of the Lagrangian strain magnitude, which can also be mapped onto the original images as shown on the left. The first and second principal stretches are plotted here. The colors represent magnitude and the lines represent their principal directions. Another feature of multi-DIC is the ability to superimpose dynamic positions into the initial reference frame by subtracting average rigid body motions. Here, the original reconstruction on the left demonstrates deformation along with rigid body motions. On the right, the results of rigid body motion subtraction is shown, such that shape changes are better visualized. In this figure, the color mapping illustrates the local relative area change of the surface, also known as the dilatation, J. Visit the GitHub repository for more information, including a comprehensive instruction manual and sample data. Developers and users are encouraged to post issues and become contributors in order to extend the toolbox capabilities.